Hey, finally, I'm back. Welcome back, everybody. It's KB here. If you haven't forgot my name yet. So after 15 days, I'm back. I was gone. I was long gone, actually. So, yeah, let's talk about the Windows 10 1809, also known as October update. What happened to the update? So I'm pretty sure that almost all of you guys already know about this. What happened to the Windows 10 1809 update and why the Windows 10 1809 update is gone. You cannot update your Windows 10 to the latest version 1809. And in this video, I'm going to tell you what happened to the update. Okay, so simply for those people who are still struggling to get an idea what happened to the update. So simply the biggest issue with the Windows 10 1809 update was that when you update your Windows 10 to the latest version 1809, it was deleting the files from your PC. So that was the only biggest issue why the Windows 10 1809 update is down and you cannot download it anymore from the official site. Okay, so you can see here, this was the really, really, really big drama uh, about the Windows 10 1809 and millions of people, maybe a couple thousands people got affected by this update they lost their files and that is a really huge deal and 15 days ago I made a video on the same topic that how to update when I was making this video there was no news about this I didn't knew about this but right after I posted this video I saw that people were complaining that something is going wrong the biggest issue was the deleting the files from the computer your files this update was deleting the files so Microsoft turned down the update and the update is no longer available so as you can see in the video when I made this video I was able to successfully update my Windows 10 to the latest version Windows 10 1809 in the video you can see Windows 10 October update is available but right now if you go and visit the official site of Microsoft where you can download the Windows 10 1809 update you can see here the Windows 10 April update is here the October update is gone now you cannot update to the Windows 10 latest version 1809 neither you can download the ISO file you cannot so the most common question in the people's mind is right now why Windows 10 October update is deleting the files from the PC so the its answer is a little bit blurry I don't know exactly what happened but I heard that there was uh, some type of feature in the 1809 update that supposed to delete the empty folders from the C drive or wherever you install the Windows 10 and unfortunately that feature deleted the actual files and folders and some people were saying that the Microsoft knew about this even they knew about this bug they pushed the update and now many people lost their files so that is true but i didn't lost it as i mentioned in my last video 15 days ago when i was showing you how to download the windows 10 1809 update and iso file i clearly said if you want to make sure that nothing is gonna go wrong when you update to the latest version or any major update you always do the backup and perform a clean installation that was my suggestion and i always suggest you guys whenever there is a major update of windows 10 any major update i make a video on them and i always suggest you guys to do the clean installation and do the backup so the thing is whenever i update just update my windows 10 to any major update I get some type of problem graphic card issue performance issue game lag my sound won't work sometime you know my internet drivers won't work so those were the things why you know I always do the clean installation and in the last video I also recommend you guys to do the same because I know the windows major updates are always like this but this time this is a really big deal but you know update is deleting the files and uh, microsoft knew about this so why didn't they just said do the clean installation it's recommended something they can give us some type of message that we have this type of bug 
it might affect your system so you should back up your system before updating or something like that so this is really stupid action from the microsoft they don't want to inform you anything about the os okay so if they can be clear with us that what's happening with the update and what's gonna happen then they should at least you know inform us before they push the update so this is really disappointed thing so yeah one more time last time i'm saying this you know we got lots of major updates throughout the years uh 2016 and this is 2018 so it's been two years so as far as i know there is no way that the windows 10 major updates are good they are not good there are always some problem and the simple reason if you want to understand this the why major updates are problems or trouble whatever you call them why they come with the bugs the simple the common sense if you want to put in this question is the you have an old version of pc like old windows 10 you want to have a latest windows version on the old version so simply if you just update your pc to the latest major update that means it's trying to keep the old os and it's also trying to add the new features at the same time so there there, there could be some type of files which is no longer needed you know in the old version because they have improved in the newer version so that could be the reason that the old system is not merged successfully anything could go wrong within the you know updating because you know you have the old uh, system and new system and you want to merge them so in between those process merging process uh, the old file might affect the newer system that's how i think okay this is my simple theory in my mind that maybe if you get the driver problem like performance issue or driver problem that's simple simple reason is that new update requires a fresh install of that driver or the driver you have installed is not capable of newer version so that's why you get the problem so that's why you know every time i update i get some type of problem so i always do the clean installation and i just don't want to talk too much but you get the idea whenever you get the major update that's the message from me okay i'm not from the microsoft helpline or anything i'm just saying that if you get any major update do the clean installation every single time do not trust the microsoft because they will never recommend you to do anything like this that's how i do it and that's how it should be done every time if the microsoft knows that you'll get some type of problem with the newer update then they should kind of recommend us something some way you know they should tell us that the clean installation is uh recommended or something you know they can do that so you can see here i have the windows 10 1809 and i'm running fine i have no problem at all because i did the clean installation and everything is running fine so the thing is if you update the windows 10 to the any major update and you get some type of problem that means you have to do the clean installation uh, so far i haven't found any major update with like clean state every major update will f your pc every single update so but the, this time this is really big deal like windows 10 18 or 9 is deleting the files getting deleted files from the pc without knowing anything like you don't know nothing about it but the files are going so this is a really big deal so people are hating the windows 10 18 or 9 update and also windows 10 and because microsoft is not clear with us they just i don't know i i can't talk too much about this but now finally let's finish this because i have talked too much so as i said windows 10 october update was available till the october 5 okay it was available after that they took down and still it's october 20 something yeah so even in october 20 after 15 days the update is still not here so what to do what if you want to get the update what if you want to get the windows 10 iso file so there is a way you can search on internet windows 10 1809 iso file but i 
I wouldn't recommend that because that's dangerous. It, th they might have modified it, the Windows 10, and might have put some files, anything, you know. So I don't recommend that. Uh, I, th my recommendation is wait for the update to come again, okay, get live again. And uh, even if you get the update again, I still recommend you guys to do the clean installation, even if they have fixed everything. I am warning you one more time, okay? So do the clean installation every time. So the another thing is that you badly want the Windows 10 1809 ISO file, then I can give you. I think I have it here. So this is the file I downloaded from here, right here, from the official site. So this is the original Windows 10 1809 ISO file. So if you guys want it badly, you want to do the clean installation of Windows 10 1809, uh, yeah, do the comment. Okay, if you do the comment, I will make a next video about it and I will upload this ISO file somewhere. It's uh, around 4 gigabyte, so it's a huge file. So I'm gonna upload it somewhere on internet and uh, I'm gonna give you the link to download it and you can perform the clean installation and you can also have the Windows 10 1809 because officially right now you cannot get the Windows 10 1809. So this is just, you know, if you only if you want, only if you trust me, okay? but. Still, one more time, I'm recommending you guys to wait for the update, then, then download the ISO file and do the clean installation and also do the backup. And do not download the Windows 10 ISO file from the internet outside of this Microsoft website. It could be anything. The ISO file you download from the outside could be corrupted, could have some viruses or something, anything, okay? so. Uh, yeah, that's my recommendation. But if you want it, I can upload it to the OneDrive or Google Drive. And it's a clean ISO file because I downloaded it from here. So it's a clean file. So yeah, if you want it, uh, I can upload it somewhere on the internet and I will give you the link in the next video. Only if you want. Do the comment in the comment section below that I want the Windows 10 1809 ISO file and I will make a video on it. And that's it that's all i want to say about the windows 10 1809 update not only the windows 10 1809 all of the ma major update of windows 10 is just effed up okay they are not good at all and microsoft will never recommend you to do the clean installation every single time you get the update they will never do that because people will get sick because people have lots of work to do they don't have time to you know re-download the windows 10 and you know do the clean installation it takes some time like two to three hours five hours so it also depends on your pc speed and internet speed so yeah it takes some time so microsoft will never recommend you to do this and uh, at least they should like do some type of banner or anything like clean installation or fresh installation is recommended something like that you know you know just don't update your windows 10 that's my recommendation if update when you have the time just don't update i mean do the clean installation whenever you have time take your time and do the clean installation every time you get the major update and that's it i'm not gonna talk too much now and it's been 15 days i'm back and uh, gonna take a few more days to make regular videos i mean yeah so for now, that's it. I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye-bye.